Midnight Masquerade Official MV. It's available in six languages. They actually put that in the title. Available in six languages. What, this is an AI song? Midnight is Ehun? Because that's a pretty cool, cool name. <laughs> We're getting serious, okay. Come on. So go on and leave me. Cause I don't think I need you. Mm -hmm. Everything's an illusion. Pull it back in a minute. Mm -hmm. Go English. Ping, we go. Everything's an illusion. Everything's an illusion. Woo. Yeah. Pull it back in a minute. Yeah, we can keep up the role play. I don't care what the rules say. Making up things to push me away. Yeah, fire burned up and dressed and love that never existed. I don't got any reason to stay. Hmm. Masquerade. Dangerous what we're doing. So over and done. I don't know who we're fooling. Wow, that was delicious. Don't quite agree with how they mixed that excellent part. If <sighs> they should have done better vocal mixing that uh, this part. But it's delicious. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, my God, that's. Who is that? Is that uh, La Serafin or New Jeans? That. <laughs> Your love is in my veins, lost in this toxic maze. I'll drink your love poison. I'm giving you a warning. Don't come any closer. Mm. No, that, that sample. That uh, female sample, we heard that in one of their songs. It was La Serafim or uh, New Jeans. I forgot who it was. We're doing a bad thing. Yo, that's freaking nice. He just took all the way this, the sound all the way out. Close the warning. Don't come any closer. I don't like that voice, how they recorded that. I mean, not the way they recorded it, how they mixed it. It's a little too weak, his voice right here. I'm give you warning. Don't come any closer. Mm. Yeah, bring it up. We're doing a bad thing. We're gonna hurt till it's over. Mm. Yeah, pushing all of the limits. Craving like it's forbidden. Touching you feels like playing with flames. Yeah, pushing all of the limits Go against what's permitted Touch you feels like playing with flames <sighs> Mask
Wow, this song is great, actually. Wow. I'm impressed. It just sounds like a Billboard hit, actually. It really does. It just sounds like freaking like uh, Maroon 5 with colliding with another artist. It's like Maroon 5 with The Weeknd together, you know? With like another like uh, DJ uh, feature. To begin with, you'll never find the end. I love it, love it, love too much. Okay, been that. I don't know who you are, but apparently you are Ehun or your AI or whatever. I don't care. Very good song. Yeah, we'll listen to this yeah, outro. Very good. A 94. This just, like, is relevant. I don't know how they came up with this, the, the use of AI or whatever, but I'm just saying, it just sounds like something we would hear on the billboard right now. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Um, <clears throat> oh, let's talk about AI and music in its future. AI is freaking amazing and freaking scary uh, because a lot of uh, a lot of AI right now is not working. I mean, it's it's starting to it's too too early for AI to really make a dent in anything. But in terms of art, it's really actually affecting it, and it's really effective already like music wise uh you know visual art wise it's already like there but it's all <laughs> you know <laughs> there's some ai songs which are freaking amazing already um and it's going to be a problem because we're going to lose the essence of human made art you know? um because it's so good, it's so good at replicating um, what hum humans do already, you know? Um, I'm going to let you listen to a song generated by AI, okay? This is not... Um, this is not Jay-Z, but it's AI generated by Jay-Z. Tell the young they can never become what they aspire to. Born in a cell with no one who can inspire you. Your highs are as never as high as those are lie to you. Pretending that they live in the sky, lying behind your roof. Shooting holes up at your ceiling, trying to find the proof, trying to fight the feeling the truth. Tied up like the noose they've been concealing. This is not Jay-Z. This is the AI impersonating Jay-Z. Dipped in and diamond, so do you find it appealing? Time for dealing. Despite y'all dealing, we are the savages, the natives who fight the appeal of all your lavish. Just the brave who find what is real and call it as it is. And use a mind wheel to escape the laws of averages. To be rich and broke, could it be broke and rich? You see, it all gets flipped by those who master this. Who give a whole new meaning to what you mastered? Shooting holes up at your ceiling, trying to find the proof, trying to fight the feeling, the truth. Tied up like the noose they've been concealing. Dipped in and diamond, so do you find it appealing? Time for dealing. Despite y'all dealing, we are the savages, the natives who fight the appeal of all your. Crazy. Scary, 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 scary stuff. We shall see what happens. <laughs> it is a great AI song. Yes, it is. 
but it's also a very scary example of what we could uh, be seeing in the future. Yes. Wow, it sounds like like him. Yes. Lyrics are... I don't know. Maybe the lyrics were human uh, created and then they just had uh, Jay-Z's AI voice rapping it. We shall see. Um, yes, so the previous song by Midnight, 94, Masquerade, it, it kind of sounds like American Billboard hits right now, like Maroon 5 collabing with somebody. Um, I like it. Um, yeah, uh, we are going to do a couple more songs. But we gotta go Fifi, or I gotta go Fifi. So, um, take a short break. Two minutes, three minutes, three minutes. All right. Hi, Namu. In about two hours, you are going to meet your older sister. For the record, I do have a lot of animals here and there. Uh, Mango is here, I'm fostering him. Another uh, a cat is scheduled to come today, but my permanent animals, my permanent pets, is Namu, this cat right here, and uh, Mari, my dog. So those two pets of mine will be permanently here, even though we see other animals that we foster. Yes, he's a very chill cat. He is. He's so cute. He does. I don't like laugh out loud, like chuckle when I'm by myself, but he makes me chuckle. It's so funny the things he does. So I, I find myself laughing out loud. Um, we have a sponsor. You guys know Corel. Um, I'm not going to play the uh, intro video. No need to, but. Today, or yesterday and today, I've been trying out this new shampoo that they are selling. It's the Kundal Shampoo and Conditioner Set. Uh, the link is down below. But, of course, I had to try it, you know? This is the RJ version. This is the shampoo, this is the conditioner. Uh, but this one is uh, baby powder. Smell and geez, it does smell really, really fantastic. Um, and yes, I've been using it and I'm continuing to use it actually because it's a really good shampoo. Uh, on top of that, they give you this little pouch, which is adorable. I love it. Thank you, Coral. Link is down below. Uh, they are the only website website online outlet uh, to uh, carry this. So if you want to get it, do you know, let me sniff your hair. <laughs> Normally, I would find that really creepy, but because it's you guys. Not surprised nor offended. And if I saw you, actually, I would let you smell my hair. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> in other news, I have just finished a track that I've been working on with my friends. Um, I am the sound director. So I've been working on a song for the last like six months with uh, one of my friends. And we have completed it. I can't give you the full version, but I can give you a preview of what is uh, coming. So this is uh, 
track one of two that we are working on. The other track, I, the other track I like better, but this track is finished, almost finished, like ninety-five percent finished. So I'll give you uh, maybe the first, first half. Second half is better, but we go. You hear it? Yeah. You like it? So my job is uh, cleaning up the mix and uh, I do have to stop like every couple seconds. There's a lot of uh, auto tune. You get a 93? <laughs> the, 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 the highlight of this song is definitely the guitar. We've probably changed hundreds of things here. Yeah. Yep. All right. That's it. You like it? You like this part more? Yes. The guitar, electric guitar is the uh, centerpiece. Uh, we had a session guy come in, play that live. There's one thing I need to get rid of sound wise. There's a little bit of a uh, static, like electronic buzz static, which is really hard to pinpoint where it's coming from. Yeah, but it's going on my playlist. <laughs> it will be published uh, rather soon. Yeah. But, uh, not all the haters saying DJ Gino is a flop. He has no music credentials. For your information, I've been a professional DJ for like as long as those people have lived DJing in a professional club. Club. Um, but yeah. Sound director. In your face. <laughs> yes. Uh, could you tell us who's the artist? I can, but uh, not I don't want to because I need to talk to him about publishing in his channel and how he's going to do it. So it, it might change. If I tell you something, it might change. That's why. But one of my dear friends uh, who trusts me in, in the sound department. <coughs> yeah. Anyways, uh, where do we go from here? We have songs left. Yes, I am not a DJ, bedroom DJ, living in my parents' basement, as a lot of people. And living off of, uh, and using BTS as my source of income. <laughs> as people like would like to think. All right, we got one more song called Taeyang. Taeyang called, uh, singing a song called Shun featuring Lisa. Shun, Shun, Shun. Performing. It's okay. Nice basement, huh? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, 
God, you gotta be kidding me, Lisa. This is fantastic. bridge though I, <laughs> I i was saying okay formula sticking to the formula but nice bridge actually Beautiful. Beautiful. Yo. Hey, young. Let's talk about this song. Oh my goodness. This has got to be the best song from YG. All of YG. Not just Big Bang, not just uh, Blackpink. All of YG in the last freaking 10 years. Holy crap. Actually, I'm going to say it. Exactly. This is the best song from YG since doo 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 doo. At least. This bass line is beautiful. Great old style reminiscent uh, uh, R&B reminiscent of the old times. Lisa just brought it. What the hell, Lisa? Can you do this always? Not La Lisa, Dala Dala, whatever, Dala Dala Dala. Do this always, or something like this. Holy crap! This is the potential I saw in Lisa. This is what I've been saying. This is what I thought would happen during her solo, but now she brings it. I mean, better late than never, but that's great collab. Wow. Well, she didn't write it. I don't care. I don't care. She did good. The way she wrapped it was great. <clears throat> ah. 94. 
the best song of the night. Really good. Oh my goodness. And I'm glad it's Taeyang. Yeah. The guy I root for. He's I I was longing for one more rap from Lisa in this song actually. It's like, wait, is it Doja Cat or freaking Lisa? What am I? Holy crap, you know? The bass line here is just yeah. delicious. Only the, the dance choreo. <laughs> it needs an update. Hey, you need some new moves, man. It's just... But I don't care. I, I don't care about the dance. It has no bearing on my score in music. It does open here. Kind of underwhelming. Shung is like room. Yeah, this is a di direct translation of room, like a like a how a, a car would pass by. It's like room, room, shung, shung. Doja. Put the pedal to the float when I hit the dough. Give me everything you got, like the bank is out. Yeah, you pull up in a Lambo that drip that shit like candles. And I lose my grip with the handle. And I choose you over the bando. You keep my engine on fire, you could never guess well how you move around the coast. Make me, oh, you got the thing that I want. Oh, you love hit the spot, and you never should stop, baby. <laughs> nice transition, too. Yeah. <laughs> All right, good job. 94, 94 it's where it's at. Good job. Shung. Yes, shung. Room. Shung, shung. Like, room, room. All right. Uh, my grades are not law. They are not set in stone either. I can change. These are my impressions. Do not get offended. Do not count for my ass, okay? I want to live. I'm just sharing my opinion. And because some people seem to be interested in what I have to say about certain songs. I'm merely sharing my opinions. Doesn't have to be law, okay? I love you all. My daughter is coming to the airport. Yes. 
I love you. Uh... Before I go, I want to talk to you about an artist. Uh, an artist that we listen to a lot here. You know this song, right? <clears throat> this it's, uh, this song is Sean, a Korean artist that is so more well-known outside of Korea than uh, inside of Korea. This song. We all know this song, right? It's We've heard this song here a lot. You know, this song has some crazy number of plays throughout the world. This guy is really big outside of Korea. This guy has remixed the songs for Ed Sheeran. This guy is worldwide and people don't know. <laughs> And it's so amazing. Like, how the hell? Then what the hell? Um, I'm gonna leave you with his remix of "Bad Habits" of Ed Sheeran, which is crazy that he remixed it. I mean, yeah, Ed Sheeran released an, a remix album of his songs, but he got the remix Ed Sheeran. I love you all. Bad Habits by Ed Sheeran by Sean. Late tonight, sitting alone, conversations with a stranger. 
for those of you who don't know, we are going to be streaming at the airport while we wait for Muddy in a couple hours, alright? I love you all. See you then. Remember when I told you no matter where I go, I'll never leave your side. You will never be alone. Even when we go through changes, even when we roll, remember that I told you I'll find my way back home. second verse is actually the Korean verse. Tell me if you like the English verse or the Korean verse better. Remember that I told you I found my way back home. 